Today is a very, very sad day. I hoped I would never have to make a video about this. I've tried filming about five times this video, but the pain is just too much. I have to stop recording. Awful, devastating news. No one's died, by the way. I found out that my favorite record store in Cardiff is closing down and not like relocating somewhere else or having a big stock clearance. They are actually legitimately 100% closing down. They will no longer exist in Cardiff. The shop I am referring to is called Head and is in fact the largest retailer of independent music and films in the UK. And they have a shop in Cardiff. It's in the brand new bit of the St. David's shopping center. It's on the second floor, kind of walk past the Apple shop towards John Lewis. Big up J. Lou, by the way. Love that shop. And then just opposite Lakeland, where you could buy all the kitchen utensils you could ever possibly need, is this gem. I walked past it the other day and there were these big signs in the window saying, closing down. And I had to go in and ask, like, is this legitimately happening? Because you know, there are always some shops that you see around that say that they're closing down for about five years in a row, but never actually closed down. But this is real. And it's just so annoying because that is genuinely the best record shop I think that I've ever been to. And that includes all the ones in London that I've been to. Purely from the perspective of just the volume of records that they have there. There are thousands and thousands of them and they not only stock all the new releases that you could ever want, but they have such an amazing like back catalog of artists and old stuff and new pressings of old stuff. They just basically, there's never been a time when I've gone in looking for something specific and it hasn't been there. And not only do they have a huge collection of music, but they also have these nice little discover areas where there will be an album just on display and it will have description underneath it written on a little piece of paper that says who the artist is, the kind of music they make, what artists sound similar to them. So I've read these description cards before and they'll say something like for fans of Olaf or Arnold and Nils Fram and I'll immediately know that I will probably really like that record. Little things like that that I just really really liked about that shop and I'm sure some people might be like oh no it's just like too commercial man but like fuck off you hipster cunts okay it's not about that it doesn't matter if it's like a chain shop something can be a chain and still be really really good. Let's have a look at the statement that they put up on their Facebook page. It's with great regret that we're announcing the closure of our store in Cardiff. We've developed a loving and loyal following since opening in October 15 and made some true friends. We'd like to thank you all for your support from the bottom of our hearts. You're very, very welcome. Head as a business is on the up and up and we are looking to open a number of new stores across the UK and Ireland this year. Brilliant. I don't live in Ireland, do I? I live in f***ing Cardiff. There's lots of exciting news in the pipeline, but Cardiff simply hasn't worked out. This is no reflection on the store, the staff, the city, or you lovely people. We have found the Welsh to be the warmest and friendliest of folk. Hmm. The store is due to close Saturday the 6th of May, so yes, we will be doing record store day. Okay, that's that's f***ing good news. And no, it will not be a half-baked offer, we will be making this the biggest and best record store day yet. If you loved what we did last year, then we will not disappoint you. Remember, the business itself is growing, and we still have the same backing and support from all of the suppliers. The fact that we are due to close the store has no reflection on our ability to deliver an incredible record store day. We'll say it again, there will be no sacrifice in quality. So that's really good. I've heard from people who have gone to the various other record stores in Cardiff on record store day and they've all said that head tends to do it the best out of all of them if you love the store then make the most of us over these next two months we love to see our regulars will continue to stock all the latest release titles as usual so please continue to make us your first port of call feel free to comment and spread the love below but please no drivel about spotify netflix downloads and the death of the record store firstly we'll only delete it Ooh, ooh, deleting and secondly it's completely inaccurate there's legs to this business and we are at the helm much love team head. I'd be really interested to know if the people who wrote that worked at the Cardiff store or if they are more sort of head office people just making a general statement. They're really trying to hammer the point home that the business itself is doing fine, which, you know, I'm sure it is, but it's still a f***ing shame that they're closing down a shop. And what this means is that after the 6th of May, the only places that I'll be able to go and buy records in Cardiff will be Spillers, which while being the oldest record shop in the world, which is a kind of very nice, interesting little fact about the place, but it is absolutely tiny. And I don't mean to badmouth Spillers, but the collection that they've got there is crap. If you want to go there and like go crate digging and like flick through all of the records, it'll take you about 10 minutes tops to get through everything that they've got. And then you've got Kelly's Records in Cardiff Market, which is fine, but it's mostly secondhand records and it's all really expensive and some of it is very obscure but not necessarily obscure in a prestigious way but still obscure enough to merit a 50 pound price tag. I don't know again I don't mean to badmouth anywhere I'm sure it's a good place if you're looking for certain things but I've gone there a few times in the past trying to find a specific record and haven't been able to find anything even close to it. And then the only other place to go is HMV. 
Sorry, I just nearly threw up a little bit. Head is the only place in Cardiff where I can legitimately spend a significant amount of time just crate digging, just looking through everything that they've got. Finding new music, finding records I didn't even know existed on vinyl. And you know how in my numerous vinyl haul videos when I talk about how I managed to get like a double 180 gram LP for like £1.50? That is always in Head. It's the only place I've ever been to with the exception of charity shops where you can get a full record for less than a fiver. It's just genuinely a little bit upsetting, I guess. I mean, all of the shopping that I do now, unless I go to the limited places in Cardiff is going to have to be done online and I really don't like buying records online. It always just feels clinical and really really boring, you know, there's no element of exploration and as I've said before, Head is the shop that offered the best exploration potential of any other record shop I've been to. They had a good selection of Blu-rays as well. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this up now. I'm sure that there is a perfectly legitimate and fair reason as to why they closed the shop down. I'm not going to start ranting and raving about like, oh f capitalism man. It's just a bit shit. And you know, to the people who have actually authorised this decision to close the place down, you know, it sucks. And I hope that everything is okay for the people who work there. Um, uh, they're always really nice whenever I've been in there. They're just It's just a great shop. It's just a really good place. It's just such a shame that it's going. It's just a massive, massive shame. I might do a vlog a bit closer to the time it actually closes down where I go in with like a hundred quid and just buy f loads of records. But yeah, that's it. Sad day. Anyway, thank you for watching, if you are still watching. Have an absolutely fantastic day, and I will see you all very soon.